Hello there guys, welcome to episode 4 of this Blackpool gameplay. We start this game off with a bid from Stockport County for Paul Simpson. I'm in a bit of a loss here at the moment. His contract is up in 02. He's getting £1,200 a week. They've offered us £26,000. Um, I might see if I can squeeze a little bit more out of them. Maybe up to the... Should we try and be cheeky and see if we can get a hundred grand? If they give us a hundred grand for a thirty-five-year-old who's out of contract for next season, yeah, he's going to have to go. It's as simple as that. I can't really compete with 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 that type of offer, especially being Blackpool at this time with no money. Um, oh, they have. Okay, so I'm going to have to accept that. Uh, so a hundred grand will be coming in. We do still have a lot of attacking midfielders, so that is the good thing about it. Uh, we all our goalkeeper who was on loan has also just gone, um, which means someone, which means Russell, uh, Mark Russell from the youth team has had to come in. We are lacking in a goal. We're lacking in goal. That's something that we're missing. With Simpson going, we will lack there as well. Um, strikers were all right. I'm not really too worried about the strike force at the moment because I'm only playing with one up front, uh, so it doesn't make any difference really. Madeira is just ultimately my out and out, you know, attacker. Um, worried that Ormerod might get a little bit disinterested, but that's something that we'll just wait and see. Up until then, there's nothing I can do about that. Uh, so with that in mind, I'm still going to play Simpson because. You know, he's, he is actually an important player of ours. We go to Berry, who are 21st in the league at this moment. We are currently second, one point off the top, but we're also three points off the playoffs as well. So there's a lot of... Um, it's, it's very compact in that area at the moment. So every game at the minute is crucial, especially coming to a team like this who are 21st in the league. You would kind of expect us to get something from here. Uh, obviously, if we're going to get promotion, ideally you'd want to win. That's not the best start to have, though. That's much better by Bullock. Uh, again, another left-back is injured. Um, Thompson's going to have to come in. Yeah, I'm going to have to just leave him like that, which is really frustrating. That's two left-backs out now. I think Hill's got injured. Now Tommy's injured as well. Two really good left-backs, actually, just out. I mean, I hope it's not for too long that they're out for. Uh, but we'll have to wait and see there. Richie Wellens, again, he's, this guy's a legend, Richie Wellens, honestly. This this is part of the reason why I decided to be Blackpool, because I knew that there were some absolute legends on this game, like Richie Wellens. Um, you've also got Bullock, you've got, uh, who was the Ormerod, who doesn't even get in the team at the minute. Uh, so there's loads of fantastic players that are just ready just to, to get on with straight away. Um, right... Okay, that's a good win. It's a big win. That's massive. It's a massive win. Um, yeah, keeps a second. That gap as well from the playoffs has just got a bit bigger, which is good. We play Cambridge next. Cambridge near the bottom. Near the bottom, so he's out for three weeks. Hill's out for three months. Oh, my days. That is not good news. I wonder if we've got a left back. We do. Ooh, he's quite quick as well, this guy. Kring got enough. I've transfer listed him I need to get these prices lower so people actually buy these guys someone needs to come and buy these guys what's going on see he's capped it is determination now I'm going to transfer list this guy I'm hoping someone will come in for them yeah Shrewsbury are coming in that's good I think Shrewsbury will always go for those Welsh players being on near the border Shropshire way yeah he's got to go he's got to go I he? It's really good. I mean, he says he's agreed terms. 35, 100 grand. I'm, sh I'm shocked that they paid that money for what's he on? Is he on less? Oh my God, he's on 5,750? No wonder he went. That's a lot of money to go to. 190 grand. I mean, gives us that little bit more, doesn't it? But there's. There's a few. Oh. He might be quite a decent... Do you know what? Do you reckon he'd come to us on loan? Pay, I'll pay all his wages. Oh, Kevin McLover as well. He's a good player. So we just try? I think any, any one of these would be really... Oh, shit. He's, he's on quite a bit of money there. Don't want to go too too hectic with the wage bill there. Uh, no, they're, they're two quite good players, though. Attacking mids. That could replace Simpson just for the season. 
Uh, I knew he'd reject it. So, yes, we've got him, though. That's good news. So he's in. So he, I think he's going to be a massive player for us here. I'm, I'm really happy with that. It's really happy. I think he's going to be a good player. It's going to be good experience for him as well, coming on loan. He's actually going to get a game. Oh, so it's been a very busy one in the transfer market already. We've got rid of a player. Um, we've already got a loanee in. Let's see how we get on. Right, Ivan Jones. Position to. Uh, here we go. Oh shit! Okay, someone's coming for Clarkson again. Do you know what? I'm actually going to reject that bid because I don't know if you heard that fly. Then go past the microphone. That was really weird. Um, I'm going to reject that bid because I actually think he could be quite a key player. We'll bring that youngster in. Um. Yeah, I think that's not a bad team. Let's just see how we get on here. I'm hoping that Kevin McLeod actually does... Oh, shite. I'm hoping that he does bits uh, for us here. Well, we need him to, really. Already bloody 1-0 down at home, for Christ's sake. Oh, my God. I thought they got a penalty then as well. That would have been it. A red card and a penalty, game over. It would have been. That would have been it. But not when Madeira is around. The guy is just a legend, isn't he? I think he's someone that you need to get you up the leagues. I think, I think next season, if we do end up getting promotion, I think he'll probably end up wanting to move. Then he'll probably ask to move to a bigger club, and then that's down to us to see exactly how much money we can get for him. Five thousand eight hundred. That's good. That. Because that the attendance is only six thousand one hundred. That's really good. Um, all right, sixteenth is Bournemouth away. We may need to rest a few players here. Okay. Let's see how we get on. Let's just finish this one. Take it one at a time. I think that's exactly what we've got to do. We've got to think of it as one game at a time. Oh, that should have been a penalty. Right, I'm going to have to have a little look here. Surely there'll be people that are tired. Get in, Madeira. Another hat trick. Oh, my God. This guy's on fire at the minute. Right, Clarkson is tired. Get him on. McLeod, he's tired. Johnny O'Connor, defensive mid. Brett Ormerod. I might just shove. Yeah, that's what I'll do. See if that works. See if Ormrod works that way. He's playing at seven already. Hey, he scored. Maybe that's the way forward. Maybe putting him behind Madeira. Who knows? Good win, though. Yeah, happy with that. I think this guy's going to be key. I really do think he's going to be key for us. Bournemouth. They must be near. Yeah, 14th. Mid-tables mid are always the worst, though. You never know what you're going to get from them. They could turn up. They might They might not. Like, I hate those types of games, really. Um, but, yeah. We'll see how we go. Okay, FA Cup. First round draw. Wickham at home. Where are Wickham here? Oh, I mean, it, it's a home game. Strachan's back. That's really good news. Let's get him in. The thing is now, what I'm realising is I've got two quality players on loan. The minute their loans are up, which I think is at the end of the season, I'm going to notice a massive difference without them. 20 grand. Go to 65 for me. Let's see if they go to 65. Nothing 65 grand. Right, same team. If we win here, then we're title contenders. Madeira's just scored straight away. I, I really do think if we if we get a win here, that there's a good possibility that we can go up. But you just you just don't know. 
there's always so much factors that go into play. I mean, I think what I realise when I play this game is that you go on a really good run. You're first, you're about nine points clear with about six games left. Then all of a sudden, you go on this dreadful run. Everyone around you starts winning, and then all of a sudden you start to panic. And then it just seems to stray away from you. That would be the worst thing. If we were in the automatic promotion places and then we went into the playoffs, that would be the worst. Redden is still with us, so a QPR. But that gap there, 22-29 points, is a good gap to have. We've got Colchester at home after this. They are near the playoffs, so that game is just going to be as important as this one. Every game is a cup final here. We need we need one more. The thing is, we're always in and around it. This is the most frustrating part. We're clearly creating chances. See, what, I just knew that was going to happen. The minute I said we were going to create chances, and now Strachan's gone off injured. Like, that's what I mean. That's my pet peeve yet again. They've scored. We have an injury. Always does my head in. That does, knocking you while you're down. Take the draw, even though we dropped a third. It's still it's still a draw away from it. Only a few days. That's not too bad, actually. Um, yeah, Colchester next. Anyway, guys, I'm going to leave it there. Like I always say, please hit that like button. Subscribe. We're doing amazing with subscribers at the moment. And, yeah, I shall see you guys later.